So the next part, the second part of our workshop, now how to feel this free energy and how to connect to your thing and express. Um, I just want to show you basically the, uh, the picture where we're going is to be able to sing, for example, without weight, and with weight. So all your body is like, you feel more freedom in your body. And that's why it brings more freedom to your sound when you play. So we're going to try to achieve this singing. And then when you play again, you're going to intonate the same way while playing, but it will really affect your muscles and your sound. So first, how to feel the spring energy. <laughs> so when people say weight, sometimes you, you know, like, feel you know, your, your, your leg is heavy, and you know, the leg is heavy, it doesn't work for me, I don't know if it works for you. So for me, free energy is when you're completely relaxed, uh, I'm sorry guys, but sometimes you know when you're a little bit of drunk, <laughs> you feel that energy, your tongue moves, you know, like you start joking, you know, this is kind of free energy that we want to achieve. So if anyone ever drunk, you can really understand it right away, okay? So we're trying to achieve this free energy. Now, how to actually gather it through your body and express it correctly? I'm going to show you first exercise, the whole routine, uh, and then we can work with individual partly. So, for you, I'm going to see this way. So, the first thing you want to do is go down completely, and your neck, like, absolutely relax. Okay, I'm going to show you the whole routine. You're going down, you relax, and then you come back. Now, after that, what you actually feel while doing this is that when you go down, you feel all free energy like in your feet downstairs. And then you go up with this kind of movement. You feel this free energy goes this way through your body, through your shoulders. And when you lean forward, you have your energy freely flow like water through your arm, elbow, hands to your legs. So basically, left knees <laughs> somewhere here is going to be your imaginary keyword here. So this is how you're going to gather weight and bring it down. So eventually, when you sit in front of the piano, of course you cannot bend forward. <laughs> that would be too funny. But uh, you need to develop this sensation to the point when you sit just straight like this, and you feel this energy go down up and when it's here you feel it's ready to pour out through your arm and you start to play while singing. Alright, so let's go. Um, the first you, I would like you to see this again, like face this that wall. Do you want to do this chair? You can Okay. You can stay here and show you all of them. No, 
I know that professional, I, I, I had a friend and she told me, yeah, this is how singers sing from diagram or something. So I'm not sure if diagram is in the stomach or somewhere here, but I just feel like my stomach just like expanding on me. Good job. Let's try just one more time. Maybe backwards. First without weight, just intonation. Okay, now get a weight. Absolutely the same as we did in the first part, but you're gonna make it with weight. So if you want, you can again just first play and make nice movements to remember what you need to do. Please do not raise. Yeah, I know it could be a little bit uncomfortable because I never did this, but it's for the sake of being able to be with you. So um, now let's sing it with weight and intonation. So out loud. So you're gonna sit like this. Oh, I want to tell you something. Why we need to sit with straight back? Can I show you? I'm oh, sorry. Because when we're gonna play with weight, and we're gonna feel like we're pushing a little bit the instrument. We're playing into the instrument, like. Uh, and you will feel like it goes like a wave inside the instrument. Okay? Now, when you sit with not a straight back, for example, like this, first of all, it looks ugly. <laughs> okay, now, when you would want to transfer the weight, everything you play goes down to the floor with this posture. So, if you want to, like, it's going to down. And uh, hence, it will not, how to say, That's not, that's not comfortable, I don't know how else to explain. <laughs> so you want to sit with back straight, straight back, and then naturally, you're going to make this energy, this energy, instead of this energy. <laughs> that's why we need to sit straight. I mean, I'm not... I'm not good, you know, when I'm in the real life, I don't usually keep my back straight, but as soon as I come to the keyboard, it's already like a habit. I become like a priest. <laughs> my back is always straight. Otherwise, I just simply cannot play correctly. Yeah. Okay, so come back. And let's remember. So you're going to play together with singing. It's a getaway first. Yeah, well, when it's here and you feel it's ready to pour out, it's time to lift your hand and let it pour out to the keyboard. Because now the keyboard is here, not there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you will have to do something like Unnecessary moments. 
I know like we all used to be taught to play like this, you know, but <coughs> it's not really efficient if we're talking about one best level. Okay, let's do one more time. Maybe this time you can do it internally. Yeah. 